God's peace be with you. Welcome to our devotional for Tuesday, April 26th. Today's devotional is based on Psalm 4. Answer me when I call, O God of my right. You gave me room when I was in distress. Be gracious to me and hear my prayer. How long, you people, shall my honor suffer shame? How long will you love vain words and seek after lies? But know that the Lord has set apart the faithful for himself. The Lord hears when I call to him. When you are disturbed, do not sin. Ponder it on your beds and be silent. Offer right sacrifices and put your trust in the Lord. There are many who say, Oh, that we might see some good. Let the light of your face shine on us, O Lord. You have put gladness in my heart, more than when we, their grain and wine abound. I will both lie down and sleep in peace. For you alone, O Lord, make me lie down in safety. So today's devotional from Daily Feast was written by Gary Simpson. Psalm 4 confirms some of the things we assert about God. God answers prayers. God gives breathing room in human suffering. God is gracious. God is the source of our safety. As God's rest on the Sabbath was an act of love, an example for us, who are made in the divine image and likeness to emulate, human rest is an act of divine trust. The psalmist declares that you have put gladness in my heart. Gladness beyond trouble, beyond the darkness of night, beyond the pain of broken relationships. And we're left with this to ponder. Which of these affirmations about God from the psalmist do you most need to hear and to remember? Let us pray. God of my life. When pain is great and there are no words, you make room for me. When my suffering offers only tears, you hear my prayers. I sleep in the peace and safety of your loving arms. Amen. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord's face shine on you with grace and with mercy. May the Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen. Thank you for joining me for today's devotional. I hope you join me again tomorrow. But until next time, whenever that may be, I pray that you remain safe and healthy, that during the current wave of the pandemic, you're still practicing social distancing, you're still washing your hands frequently, and when you're out in public, you're wearing a mask for the good of others as well as yourself. God bless.